Hello, today I'm just going to talk about colourless. I'm going to demonstrate this weird colour strip on my hair. So my hair, as you can see, is really dark right now. This isn't its natural, well, it is my natural colour, but this is artificial colour on that hair of mine because I went to a salon and got my hair like balayaged really nicely by this lovely, lovely stylist. And it was a cool colour and then I got bored because I'm impulsive and I'm a little bitch, so I just decided to destroy my hair. And I used like pink hair dye and like purple hair dye and all this other shit. So my hair got pretty damaged. Basically, yeah, so my hair fucked up and then I put purple hair dye in it and that was cool for like a month and then it faded out to this like rose gold colour and it was really pretty. And like my hair does still feel really dry but like because it's dark you can't see it. But the only reason I want to try and strip it is because I really just want to know what colour is underneath all of this. So when I dyed it with a brown hair dye, before that it was like a, the faded rose gold colour. So like some bits were coming out blonde, but most of it was kind of like pinkish. But yeah, uh, I normally use colour oops, but they didn't have it in Sainsbury's. So we're going to try this weird metallic space age colourless. It says it has a fresh fragrance, and I really hope it does, just because they normally smell like rotting eggs. So without further ado, I'm just going to put this on. One hour later. Actually, it doesn't smell as bad as I thought it would. I don't know if you can tell, but it's definitely gotten lighter. I'm so excited to wash it out and see what happens. I have to rinse off this thing for five minutes with warm water. Then I apply half of this bottle, massage like a shampoo for one minute, and then rinse again for another five minutes. And then apply the remainder of the bottle for a minute and rinse for another five minutes. So in total you're washing your hair for about 15 minutes. I'm excited to see what color it goes because normally it goes super light in this stage. You wash it out, it's fine. You apply this and suddenly it gets really dark because it oxidizes, so. This is my hair like straight after I got out of the shower and I've like towel dried it kind of, but it's not like completely dry. I think I'll just let it dry overnight and then I'll show you guys tomorrow in the morning with like daylighting and stuff. I'm not sure if it was like lighter when I washed it out and then the thing oxidized because I think it did get a bit darker in the shower but like that's kind of to be expected because I've worked with colour strippers before and I know that's what they do. Like, I'm liking the the colour and it has stripped quite a lot of it so I guess I'll just see tomorrow um, what it looks like dry. Uh, hey guys it's the morning. Sorry it's not really gross but um, this is what the hair colour came out as so it's like not blonde, but pretty, pretty close to what it was before I dyed it. Um, Brown-ish. Like I think this is what the pink faded. That's what it looked like color-wise. But I'm really pleased with it. It's not too bad. 